Hi, y'all. Welcome back to Walking Dead, episode two. Okay, so what happened last time was we basically just started the game. So we met Clementine, and she's as cute as yes, a button. Yes, I'm in love with her. Me too. And we went to the farm and saved Duck. Then we met Larry and Laura, and Larry is a jerk, yeah. but he needs his heart medication. Yes. So we're trying to help him find it. And yeah, so I guess yeah. we'll just see where the game takes us. Yeah. Continue. Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out of here. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Yep. Yeah. Tough job. Mm-hmm. All right, then. Okay, so there was some stuff. Okay, here we go. I don't remember them very well. Oh, I wonder if that was his family or something. Okay. Oh, we can't see him. I know, I love that it's not showing me. It's like, oh, battery. Okay, cool. So that was one, but we need two. He's going down memory lane. Sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead. <laughs> what do you say? He's going down memory lane. Yes, he is. Okay, so we got one battery, so that's great. Got one battery. Oh, I guess I could give her the battery, the one I have. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. Still need to. Oh. Oh, what is that? Oh, I thought that was a battery. Looks like it. Maybe not. Okay. No pressure. Okay, let's talk to Glenn. How are you doing, Glenn? You know. Okay. Do you know the combination? Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? Oh, you know. I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. <laughs> oh, I thought he meant his leg. I was like, <laughs> damn. What's your next move? What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Exit. Try to get some rest. Huh. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. Okay, quit holding your heart. I know you need medicine. I'm, I'm sorry. No pressure. Yeah, literally. Hey, Clementine. Clementine, how many look for that battery? Literally. Hi. Can I get you anything? Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. We should get to know each other. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm mm -hmm. fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. <laughs> She's like, okay. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> How's your finger? It keeps saying How's that, so. Finger, good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. good. I know I'm not your dad. Oh. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Aww. Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, Just no. Me. You know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. We'll sit tight. Okay. Okay, and then I'll give her... Or, do you want to give her a little bar? A little bar, what do you mean? She said she was hungry. Oh, yeah, definitely. 
It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. What is it, a candy bar? A protein bar. Oh, cool. You're like, oh, ooh, there's something on the floor. What is it? Battery. Nice. Very good. Good news, Carly. I got your freaking battery. Batteries. Yup. Should be able to get it to work now. Yeah. Better. Okay, then let's freaking use it. It's still not working. Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Maybe you hold it down. Can you hold it down? Mm -mm. No, it won't let you. Nothing. Bang the dang thing. Yeah, literally, like he said, bang it. No, oh, I didn't know he said that. Oh, what's this? Flip the radio over. Oh, battery door. Okay. She got them in right? That's what I was just... No, they're in wrong. That'll do it. She's like, I told you I didn't know anything about batteries. <laughs> Girl. It's not called common sense or nothing. You fixed it. Yeah, I put the batteries in correctly. Pretty simple. Contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full uh, Okay. Uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Okay. Steve. How are we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yes. So oh, let's have to look out. Wow. Sorry. Can you then? Um let's I think now that we around. have the axe, okay. we could break the gate, grab the brick, throw the thing through the thing. Then go get my brother. Oh, good idea. Nice okay. thinking. Thank you, Mama. You're welcome, babe. God, this awesome. I, okay. Now to distract those things. Careful. Give me the brick. I can't reach that brick. How? Open the gate. Here we go. Damn, you didn't have to open that wide. I know, literally. Okay. Give me the fucking brick. Before I freak out! Okay. Brick through window. God, imagine he doesn't throw it hard enough. Okay. They're like, TV! Yeah. Let's go! Three TVs! Me in a zombie apocalypse. Oh, I meant to watch TV. <laughs> oh. Now's the time. That's what you meant. It's what I meant. Okay. Hi, brother. R.I.P. Be careful. I wonder if he's gonna put his brother Be out of his out misery. Okay. Yeah, but I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would die for them. So, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. I'm sorry I wasn't here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But knowing you are to take care of all of it, that helps. Mm. Oh, wow, that'd be tough as nails. Yeah, it would be. Mm. Mm. <gasps> he didn't hit him in the head. I wonder if he's going to come back to life. I know. Oh. Yep. You're right.
Oh, why are we doing, why are we chopping his head off? This is horrific. Yeah. Just split his head open with that pointy end. I know. Yeah, literally, stab him in the brain. I know he probably doesn't know, but. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Okay. He took a chunk out. Sorry. Okay. I hope his parents uh, um, he don't have to do that to them. God, I know. Go. Holy crap! What? Run! Uh, All right, let's go. How are they gonna lock that door back? Go, go, go. I know, seriously. Fuck, that sucks. Yeah, you're right. Mm. Oh crap, okay. Let's move quick. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. Okay. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. <laughs> Let's yes, get it. Yes, he knows it. Is. All right, lady. That's the door to the pharmacy. <sighs> we should be able to find pills for Larry in there. What? You're embarrassing me. What do we need the brick for? No, we don't need the brick. We used it to open that window. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay, let's see. Is there anyone dead in here? I'm scared, probably, huh? Yeah. Probably a pharmacist. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hurry. Ooh, ruh -roh. Yeah. Screwdriver in the back. Free weapon. Three against how many? We don't know. What am I doing? Okay, I'm not really sure what to do. I'm not gonna lie. I guess you know now. We don't make it through this. You should know that I think you're a great guy. Aww. Shut up, Doug. Mom, what? <laughs> Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. <gasps> I should know what? Oh, no, 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 wow. no, 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 he can't do this by himself. Mm -mm. Oh my god, okay. I'm telling how many zombies there are. Yeah. I found something. Good job. Okay. Nice. Dad's cane, I hope you work. <gasps> Fuck! Oh my god! No, 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 no! Oh no. Save Doug or Carly. Who do you want to save, Mom? Carly. She has the gun. Oh my god. Good thing, too. Fuck. Hurry now. Let's go save Doug. Fuck, oh, uh -oh. no. Oh my god. Let's go. 
shit. You got done. Woo! Oh no. You gotta move. Get the get the fucking thing, the screwdriver. Come on. Oh, I can't. Okay. Wow. After I saved you? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Oh my you god. Damn, they're taking Holy over. shit. Oh, that Larry motherfucker. Yep. He's all strong now. Yeah. You're so he Fucking weak heart bitch. Yeah. Get him, girl. <laughs> Damn, I can't believe dog. I know. Well, I'm glad he got the picture of his family. Yeah. I hate that he wasn't in it, though. Oh, fuck. Shit. It's all right, Mama. Hey, Glenn. Disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage nine catastrophe. Augusta, stage. I think I need to go. To Atlanta. Yeah, I got friends there, and I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Damn. Yeah. I forgot about her. You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Okay. <laughs> It is kind of crazy. I don't know if this is his car, but it's like what we're letting one of the vehicles we have yeah. go. Like, what? That's exactly right. Okay, who would you like me to walk up to next? Him. The family? Okay. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Thanks you. Yeah, that's nice. You got it. Coming from a dad. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I think now we can walk up. Let's see. Oh, I don't know where the girl went. Camera angle's weird. I guess you just, you, they just, you walk up to whoever you can find. Yeah. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a, it's just that, I think that I liked him. Mm. I'm sorry, Carly. I'm sorry, Carly. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. 
I was gonna help you both. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. You I just wish we both could have <laughs> done it, you know? <laughs> me too, Curly. Oh, the kids are hanging out. That's cool. Yeah. Fucking piece of shit. Yeah. Super dinosaur was toast. That's time I saved your you know life. What? Yeah, literally. Should have oh, let you die. Then... Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Oh. Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's. I got grabbed again. Hmm. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie talkie broke. Oh, no. Glenn had the other one. <sighs> it's just walkie talkies. It's just a walkie-talkie. It probably wasn't much use to begin with. It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. Aww. And now they're gone. Nice job, it's Mom. Gone. Yeah, I know. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Mm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, mm. man. Clementine, another thing. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me. Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you... You watch your ass. Hey, I don't think I Lee? deserved that. Do you mm -hmm. have a second? Bitch! My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. I wish you were. Yeah. That Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. I'm enough man You're for you, though. To have you. Damn. <laughs> Did they hear the ominous that's music? That's the sound too? of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me I too. doubt it. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Okay. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Feeling awfully confident. Oh, <gasps> there went the light. Oh, damn. And that's the end of the game, Mom. Wow, that was quick. Oh, wait, I don't want to see the next time on. That was ridiculous. <gasps> oh, look. Okay, honesty. Oh, gosh. You and 36% uh, of players lied. So that means that we are in the minority of people who lied to Herschel. Yes. Okay, 50-50 on who chose Duck, so we're right, we're just, you know, 50-50. 50% of players have decided to defend Kennedy, Kennedy, Kenny, you and 55% of players refused the gun. Oh, where you didn't let her, um, kill herself. Um, and then who would you save, Doug or Carly? And we were in the minor majority oh, of good. people who did that. I love that they do that, because it's always yeah. fun to see. The story is tailored by how you play. If somebody don't know that this late in the game, I got news for you. Damn. <laughs> Three months later. I was going to say, where the heck are we? Three months later. Hello, Dad, mister. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. How are these uh, zombies? I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Who Maybe is this? shouldn't have opened the door. 
You got Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Not enough. Not enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some people might have to go without tonight. Some people. You mean Lily's lottery again? Kenny's gonna be pissed. She thinks everyone should have an equal chance of missing a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Do we yeah, know who Lily is? I don't Kenny think so. Lily fighting all the time. Things are getting pretty tense. Actually, wait, no. I'm pretty sure Lily is the daughter, right? Oh, okay. I think so. It's back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's better off without us. Maybe he'll be better you didn't off expect without that, us. Did you? Didn't. We'll have three fewer mouths to feed. And one fewer gun hand. Deal. One way or the other, it's a bad situation. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Mm. Yep. He does. Oh, I'm sorry. I was looking at the guy. He's just looking out for his daughter. He's just... Uh, would be nice. Looking out for his daughter. We will. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. Amen. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. <laughs> and didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. That poor bird is everywhere. It is. Looks like he's gonna get shot. Yeah. Can you make that shot? It's a long shot. I hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Damn yep. it! Waste the bullet. Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! Yelling. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. <sighs> Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out camp? here? I don't know, man. Who raided your camp? I, I don't know, guys with guns. Please. We won't bother you, I swear. Please, this is fucked up. You gotta help him. Please. Man, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if yeah, you can right. get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Was he bitten? Was he bitten? Bitten? No, I swear. Hurry, please, hurry. Uh-oh. All right, everyone be very quiet. Hey, this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Damn. Uh, oh no. Okay. We're gonna have to cut his fucking leg off. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Okay, look at it or use the axe. There has to be use a way the out axe. of this. Yeah, get out of there. Sorry, dude. No, no, no! Try the trap again! And he's gonna get the cheese! Oh my goodness! Let's go! Let's go! Mm. Mm. It has to be now! Oh my gosh! Mm. One more? Oh my 
goodness. Damn. You better hurry. He passed out. He's in shock. Mm-hmm. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Come on, frat boys. Yeah, literally. Who's carrying him? I can't see. Him. Behind you! Um Travis! <gasps> come on, come on, we gotta move! Go run, motherfucker! Run! Come on. Oh, what are you? Oh, that wow. Mm. Damn, this is already pulling his intestines out. Fuck. Ooh. Oh, we're still here. Mm hmm. They put up barbed wire. Starved for help. Mm. No question about that. Mm hmm. Oh, they found a soccer ball. Nice. Open. We've got wounded. Shit. What the hell are they doing? Come on. Come on. Be. Yep. What happened? Oh, what's going on? I have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee. What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I thought we could save his I life. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right now. That's kind of well, true. hang on. Mm. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. <gasps> We've got maybe a week's worth left. Wow. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. <gasps> what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's it running matter, out, in suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Most people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? I love that she dismissed him. I know. Okay. I can't believe he listened. Think this is I easy for me. Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Damn. Wow. How do you do that? 
That was suck. Yeah. You only have four food items for ten hungry people. Wow. I'd say nobody eats. Fuck. You need oh. to give it to the adults to keep the energy up, though. I was thinking the same thing. I, I want to feed the kids, but... Yeah. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Damn. Oh, is this what we have to do now? Okay, so we have to do it now, Shar Shar, to... We can either talk... To, well, actually, I guess let's talk to people first. Yeah. And then maybe some people will be like, I don't need anything. Yeah. I doubt it, but... Maybe. Okay, let's talk, yeah. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure, what do you need? Sure, what do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but please, this man has no leg. It's what your husband wanted. It's what your husband wanted. <sighs> Figures. I love that man to death, but I swear sometimes he's dumber than a bag of hammers. <laughs> well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Okay. Let's see who else we can find. Yes. What the hell is this? Are those probably empty soup yeah. cans? Looks like it. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Wow. <laughs> Okay, so he made a comment about feeling weak. Yes. This dumb piece of shit. I don't give a fuck if he starves yeah. to death. Well, it's your choice in the end, but that's my opinion. Oh, I agree with that one. So at least now we only have nine hungry people to worry yes. about. How are you doing? The kids are definitely time? out. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? I don't have time. Sorry, honey. I don't have time. That was my favorite hat. Oh, it was the one her dad if gave I her. It, I know. But we got to find food Thank for you. everything. Okay, Claire. Uh, I've got to take care food. of some things. Yeah. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Duck is boring. We should think about leaving here. Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. I know Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. But this is a good spot. We're protected, we're close to the drugstore, we have a routine now and it's working. For now. Want some food? Wait, but then we're gonna give her food. Oh, okay, um, let's talk about you and Kenny. How about that? Yes. We should talk about you and Kenny. What about us? They're arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here, and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. Excellent. Keep an eye out. You check Fine. that before I said it. Well, because I know you wanted to talk to everyone first, right? Okay. <laughs> hey, is my friend going to make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So who are you? So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. How are you holding? How are you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of, I don't know, something. You did all you could. I'm sure you did all you could. Yeah, maybe. Want some, no, exit. <laughs> want some, no. Right. I want to offer so everybody the food. Normal in no time. I sure hope so. Okay. Who do you want to talk to, Duck or Carly? Carly. Sleeping any better? Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. 
Drugstore? Yeah. God, three months later, poor girl. I'm giving out food, what should I do? Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food. No. Oh, that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food, too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Nice. Thanks, Carmen. Sweet. Exit. Back in a bit. Okay, and then you want to talk to Duck, Clementine, or... Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. Duck, Clementine, or Kenny? Um, Clementine. Oh, she's so cute. You still have that walkie-talkie? That thing doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Just gonna hold on to it then? Yeah. She's like, I if told that's you that. okay. Yeah. I, um, I need it. It's okay, hon. You said they'd find us. I Ooh. know, I did. And until then... Look, uh, Clementine. I'm not stupid, Lee. I know it's just pretend. But it makes me feel better. Wow. Okay, you take good care of it then. Poor girl. I will. Are you doing okay? How you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I hope he will. I'm so hungry, Lee. I hope I get to eat soon. Uh -uh. Oh, Clementine. Damn. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. That's cool. The coast does sound like... The coast go. does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Okay, now we just talk to Duck. Do you think that's a good idea for him to leave with him? Um, I don't know. I really don't. Thank you for You're asking. You're a pretty brave kid. You're you welcome. were pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. That's sweet. How you doing? How you doing, Duck? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? <sighs> it's a you cat, know? you oh, asshole. I know. It's a goat, right? No. <laughs> no. Later, Bye, Lee. Okay, Shar Shar. So who are we giving the food to? Okay. Let's see. We got Lily up here, which she's the one who's been giving out the food. We got Kenny, our girl Carly, the kids, this random ass guy, and then uh, Ken's wife, who is sewing the guy up. And then this guy who said he was feeling weak, and then the piece of shit. Okay, Ken's wife, because she's always helping out with the um, wounded. Okay. So let's go to her first. She'll probably say, no, give it to my son. I was thinking that Here, also. Eat something. <sighs> Why don't you give it to Duck? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Wow. I need space, Lee. Okay, I okay, guess you're then. not getting it. So, are you want to give it to Duck or give it to someone else? Give it to somebody that's being productive. Okay, so... I guess the weak guy. Okay. Here, eat something. Give an apple, piece of jerky, crackers, and cheese. Crackers and cheese. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Give axe to Larry. Larry, this I mean guy? to say Mark. Okay. 
Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You're you didn't right. think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. No. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. Like, he thinks that he's been gonna be an asshole to us all the yeah. time and we're gonna fucking feed him? Right. Alright, we got two more pieces of food. No, three more pieces. Oh, three? Yeah, so we can give some to Lily. We can give some to this random kid. These two kids. Carly or Kenny. Um, okay. Um, Lily. Okay. Here. Apple, jerky, or cheese? Half an apple. I don't want anything from you. Wow, take it anyway. You're nicer than I am. Take it anyway. You need to eat. This doesn't change anything. Nice. <laughs> okay. All right, let me change camera angle. So these are our... So the mom over there said to give the food to Duck... Or we got these guys. And right. Clementine said she was hungry. Kenny. Want something to eat? Give a piece of jerky. Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. Okay, we're going to take care of both the kids. But if, we, okay, if we take care of both the kids, that's all the food. I know, but nobody wants it. Okay. And college boy, we don't know how long it's been since he's eaten. Okay, and you don't want to give any to Carly. Yeah, I don't mind giving it to Carly, but she's going to say the same thing. Feed duck. Okay, so what do you, what do you, what do you want to do? Feed the kids. Which one we want, what do you want to feed first? Clementine. Hey, Clem. You need something to eat. Jerky or cheese? Cheese. Yeah. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Bro, yeah, ever why don't we need to get some food? Yeah, why don't we get get the food? Fix and get some right now, kid. Alright, poor Carly. Keep the last for yourself, give it for someone else. Give it for someone else. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Poor hey, Carly Doc. watching these fucking kids eat. Food. Here. Yeah! Oh man, I'm Hope so you get good hungry. tea. Duck and his family appreciate that. Yeah. I know they do. Fucking Lily, you stupid bitch. And great the last. <laughs> <laughs> Not such an easy job, is it? I don't know. No biggie, right, Mom? Right. Pretty okay. easy. I know you're, you're still watching it. that for me. Oh. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee, Kitty, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. Good thing I'm we did that. I'm yeah. offer to come with us. But my choice. <laughs> more than earn a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? <laughs> There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. Oh, wow. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Ken, Lee, come here, please. If you just take me off. He? Yeah, literally. He lost too much blood. <gasps> God no damn way, it. No way, no I'm way, no way. sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing. What's his problem? What's his problem? Don't be like that, Lee. <gasps> I know we've all seen death, but that doesn't make it any easier. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? I don't know. <laughs> oh my gosh. The axe. 
Oh, no! Oh, no! Back to, okay, key to get away. Fuck! Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh my god. Mm. Come on, somebody. Oh my god. Damn. You okay? Yeah, thanks. I am now. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Shut. Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Bro, I you hope you have a heart attack. Bitten. What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no. He wasn't. Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife. What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. Mm. If you don't oh. destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's Dang. gonna happen to all of us. Fuck. We're all inject infected. We're all infected? Everyone? I I guess so. I don't know. I all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. Damn. A lot of them. Wow. Um. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Mm. Back off! <gasps> what? Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we, we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. Are you armed? Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. You think? Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Oh, wow. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Good. So, uh, what do y'all think? Okay, we'll go to the dairy. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. You decided Sounds everyone fair. should go. A couple gallons should power one of our generators. Couple for a while. gallons? I was gonna say, where are we getting this gas? So how, this yeah. Dairy. You guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Wow. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. Yeah. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Mm. Nice. Oh. Me as leader? You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You've got to let go of that guilt. The Lee I know is a good man. Mm. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Ooh. You know what happened. You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? 
I grew up in Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Kenny. Kenny's a guy who really keeps a group together. <laughs> Don't let Lily hear you say that. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Enough to defend ourselves? Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys... Yeah, why the fuck well, do you guys want to know so much? get you yeah. all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mom's been running a dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys will keep it there's all to yourself! Oh no, there's yeah, a you know lot what? more We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Damn. Fuck you! Wow. Fuck you! Jesus. Bullets. Yeah! world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. I wonder if you shot him in the head. Me too. Doesn't look like it. Mm-mm. That's what I want to do to Larry. Yeah, I don't blame you. Oh, nice farm. Yeah. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Mm, it's cute. I'd love yeah, to live here. Beautiful. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. That looked like. Gotcha. Yes, it did. This is a brilliant setup. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Lily keeps us focused on survival. Lily, it's tough as nails and keeps us focused on what it takes to survive. Lily was in the military, like me. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh yeah, um... I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We're awfully hungry. We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. They fresh this morning. Oh, oh, amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. Mm. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Who's Mabel? Your cow is sick? What's she... We have oh. a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you big feast. So, wow, they do have food. It'd be mm -hmm. nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Get to cooking, boy. <laughs> why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along? I was going to say, someone needs to go with her. Yeah. See you in a while. Bye. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. 
It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. Now, you can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? We should do whatever we can to help out. They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some help securing the perimeter, then that's what we do. What we do? <laughs> Okay, hey, let's see. Take a look at Swing. Talk to Mark. Talk to Mark. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Securing the perimeter. Getting the perimeter secured is going to help us a lot. We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm going to get back to it. AKA, shut the hell up. Yes. Oh, we wanted to look at the swing. Mm -hmm. You're like, that's funny. I don't recall saying I wanted yeah, to do I didn't. that. Yeah, I did. That's very funny. Weird. What are we worried about a swing for? I don't know, because we have children. I was going to say, are we thinking about broken. children? I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Fix it. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. How long since it's been used? When was the last time it got any use? Mm, been quite a while. I don't exactly have a lot of kids visiting anymore. I look forward to the day when kids can just be kids again. Amen to that. Looks like it just needs a new board for the sea. And some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Okay, noted. We will keep an eye out for that, won't we, Mama? Yes. Mama. Mama. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? Hmm. This place was my daddy's life. Meant everything to him. You know, when he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. Oh, I huh. love that. Mama, yeah. She was done after Dan. <laughs> my folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of Daddy. Aww. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. Okay, Bye. no response. <laughs> He's like, okay. Mmm, fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. It's right over here. Oh, rope. This rope is perfect for the swing. They're like, you can't use that. I was going to say, help yourself. Why aren't you going to the house? Okay. I just wanted to check everything out first. Well, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can give. When will dinner be ready? <laughs> when will dinner be ready? it would be a while still, but it'd be worth it. Trust me. How's your family holding up? How's your family been holding up since, uh, you know? All my boys have been my saving grace. They both left their jobs and came home to help out after the attack oh, started that's good. happening. I think it was hardest on Andy. Dan was always more of a mama's boy. But don't tell him I said that. <laughs> <laughs> How many rooms in the house? How many rooms does this house have? Rooms? Why do you ask? Sorry, that was rude. I'm sorry, that was rude of me. Well, don't you worry about it, Lee. 
We've got a great big dining room that will fit your whole group. Place looks amazing. Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. We'll have a new staff. What happened to the rest of your staff? Oh, we've had our share of tragedy here. Just like everyone else, I'm sure. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night those things showed up here. It was a tough night. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Now go check with Andy, like I told you. Yeah, literally. She's like, stop bothering me, yeah. honey. Trying to cook you a big meal. Those biscuits look good. Yeah, they did. Okay, now I can officially help, right? Yes. What's this? You take them board from the Ooh, pits. Ooh, look! Pointy. Pointy, that was weird to say, Lee. He's looking for wood. This yeah. is too big right now. But if I can find something to cut it down to size, hmm. this might make a good Where's seat the for the axe? Maybe the saw that's sitting right next to oh. it. Oh. Hmm. I didn't even see that. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. You know, I'm just fixing the swing. No big deal. Not helping you with the fence like yes. that. I love swings. They're I so do fun. too. Yeah, they are. Okay, let's go fix this freaking swing. Yay! All right, this shouldn't be too tough. It's just gonna cut back to Lee. Whee! Yes. Ow. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully, our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness! Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. She's like, you weren't here. I know. He's shaking. I'm doing that. Oh. <laughs> He's scared. He's very scared. Now I think we... Oh. Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? I'm curious about your barn. How secure is your barn? Having a safe place for the cows is pretty important. Thanks to the fence, nothing gets in here anymore. Unfortunately, the daddies took most of our cattle before we got it mm. running. Mind if I take a look? Sure, but uh, why don't we do that after we tend to the perimeter? Sounds good. Good idea. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? We can help you protect the dairy. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Let's go fix the perimeter. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Now, do we have a gun? We don't have a gun. Lily has it, right? No, we have an axe. Well, Oh, yes. we still have the axe? Yeah, we just have the okay. axe. Well, we can do some good damage with that. Yes, ma'am. Do you think we're doing enough to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over-anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. 
Uh, everyone besides Laird. <laughs> so no doubt. Yes, if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I, I'm, I'm sorry. Gossip. Yeah, literally. We'll work it out somehow. You're nicer than me. I would have said he's a piece of shit. We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. Ooh. There's one. Ew. Ugh. Fried to a crease. Please, yes. It's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Okay, um, look at light. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Yeah. I think it's silly because he's not shot in the brain, but okay. Hey, yeah. The John boys are using this guy for target practice. Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, Whoopi was already dead. Who do you think he was? Maybe a farmhand. Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Yep. Looks like he's stuck. Gross. Looks like he's stuck. What do we need the arrow for? I think it was maybe stuck into the fence. Oh, good idea. Yep. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Fortress needs people to defend it. The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. We can take this place if we have to. <gasps> Damn! Yeah. We'll take yep. this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. There's another one. I see it. I'm not blind, Lee. Oh, she's sure to climb it. Oh. Right, right. Uh -oh. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Mmm. What do you do? Oh my god. You never get used to the smell, do you? Mm. <laughs> nope. I didn't think about that. Yeah. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. We'll go ask for more to eat after. We'll go ask for more to eat after this is done. All right. I can suck it up. Ooh, this part of the Come fence on. came down. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. <laughs> I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Oh, good idea. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Yep. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. Get to it, Ling. Little help yeah. here, Lee. Okay. I'm scared. I know. They both got their back to it. Holy fuck! Ooh. What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ooh. Oh my god. Fuck! What the? Get to the gate. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Get down. You Jesus. Who is it? The bandits, I think. Oh. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on that gate, it's our only way out. You didn't deliver the goods. Now we're gonna take what to. I see you. What about all our arrangements? Now there you go. The plates are stuck in the dirt. Ooh. Hmm. What, they made a deal with somebody else? I guess they maybe made a deal with the... Uh, of course. Bandits? Yeah, maybe. 
Who the fuck are you? I already got one of you can do this all day. You asshole. Huh. You really think you can fuck with that food, you asshole? Damn. Behind the tractor. Oh, 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 okay. Come on, here we go. Here we, go. we can reach the gate. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Shit, that get to the gate. Okay. Did you really think you were fucking us? Don't take our chance to you. I'm afraid Mark's gonna die. I know. <gasps> Shit, the fucking zombie right there. Damn it! Fuck! What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. Oh, shit. oh my god. Another one. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Like three. Yeah. Mother <laughs> 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 Asshole, fuck you. Come on! Oh! That'll do it. Okay. No, that won't because that head's still. True. You're right, you're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah. Fair. Come on. The gate's right Shit. there. Holy oh, moly. Keep going, Lee. Uh oh. He's getting close. Did you really think you could fuck with us? Thank God. Nice. Let's get out of here. Okay, now close the gate. I guess it doesn't matter at this point. Wow. Damn. It was a goddamn ambush. It was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? The bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Yeah. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. It was a, a fluke. fluke. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down. But I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Ooh. I wonder if these people bandits? have guns. Are you serious? I don't know. Good question. This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor in. Right. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool. Well, you said jets that. there, Rambo. Yep. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys to try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Mm. Yeah. That's right. real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Uh oh. Hey, Is everybody kid, gonna be okay? Look what Lee know. got working for you. A swing. I love swings. Just like at my tree house. Come on, Doc. Thanks, Lee. You're the best. Aww. Yeah. So sweet. 
See, I'm not a piece of shit, Larry. Like yeah. you think I am. We are trying to prove ourselves to Larry. That's true. Okay, so we got a few options. Okay, let's see. Look at gas cans. Look at outlet. Use gate. Look at generator. Electric fence. Or we could go find them to help them. Go find them and help them. Okay, are they over here? No. Oh, there they are. Okay. Hi, guys. Fellas, how you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. Yeah, yeah, maybe. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Who the fuck yeah. are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's go. Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Oh! Yeah, she is very cute. And she knows See anything. Mm -hmm. Not yet. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Campbell soup. Oh shit, you found it? That's close. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I was looking at things. Stay on your guard. Oh, I'm sorry. I missed it. What is it saying? I, he, he said nothing. Yeah, he didn't. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out. I was looking tent. at the tent. That's okay. You forgive me. I don't know. Mm hmm. stuff this camp's too small it can't be their main base that's what i was thinking take a look around anyway there's probably some shit around here they stole from us okay just water box great Nothing. Empty. Damn. Whole lot of nothing. Keep your eyes open. Looks like they expected to be here a while. I thought we already examined the tent. I think that we can look. Like I said, it looked like there was little kid stuff in there, so no. maybe we'll find something for Clementine. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days, they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? There's too much for one person. This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Oh. 
boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Oh. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. That's a camera? Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they no got good. over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily? I thought you said uh, Kenny was running things back there. Yeah, but uh, uh, she's got the combat training. We already said this. I know. They're trying to catch us alive. Okay, let's see if there's anything from Miss Clementine. Or Duck. Oh, I just meant because it was girl stuff in there, but that's true. You're oh. right. Maybe Duck wants one of the stuffed animals or something. They could probably use a stuffed animal on both of them. Yeah. Why are you putting oh. that gun down? Oh! Oh! Huh. Uh oh. The <gasps> what? Hell? Don't fucking move. <gasps> Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal what everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here, but it weren't safe. Not for me, but not for my girl. They didn't Aww. treat her nice. Not at Aww. all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I faked them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Where take did you get Clementine's hat? Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? A little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Ooh! Yeah, oh my goodness. Right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm going to head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir. I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> So this is Clementine's Go mother? On. No, Tell I don't him, think so. Tell think... him what you got in mind. Oh. I did not see that coming. Although she had they had to do it. Yeah. God damn it! I was gonna shoot her myself. I was five seconds away from shooting her myself. Well maybe you should have. <laughs> It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Poor woman. I feel bad yeah. for her. That's horrible. So she wasn't Clementine's mother. How come it seemed like she was? She, she that, the, the picture we looked at, it showed another little girl. Oh. Yeah. Okay, you're and right. And they took her daughter. Oh, I didn't get the little bunny for Clementine. I really wanted to. Oh. Come on, yeah, let's get the bunny. Let's get the bunny. Not an option, I guess. Dang. Sorry, Clementine. Yeah. And Duck. 
Mm-hmm. At least we got our hat, though. Yeah. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. 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 This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Guys, don't fight if we want to stay here. Yeah. Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? <laughs> don't mind them. Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. <clears throat> we all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Keep talking Lee, about it. Don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Who is that? Um, Kenny's wife. She's oh. the one that tried to save that guy. Yeah, with the leg. I didn't know that was her name. Katya, yeah. Hi, sweetie. Oh, and she closed us I out. I guess she did. She don't want her hat. <laughs> okay, let's take a look around, shall we? Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. This place is isolated. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. You run this place with just one cow? How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry, too. Or sick. You got your doctor friend here. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. Yeah. You really like that gun. You really like that gun. What's not to like? <laughs> not much, I guess. Not much, I guess. Exactly. Okay. I'm you don't need to rub it. Yeah. It'll be a good one. Why is Creepy it? Creepy voice. I was gonna say! He's a little too into that gun. Make everyone happy. What'd you say? I said he's a little too into that gun. He is. Let's check some stuff out. They're storing gasoline all over the property. I'm glad Andy knows how to fix this if something goes wrong. I'm clueless about this stuff. It's a small toolbox. A multi tool. That should be handy. Just gonna borrow this for a second. They're like, uh, yeah. Excuse right. me. What are they doing about that fence they left open? We fixed it. Oh, did we? Are yeah, you sure? that's how the guy got shot because we were on the opposite side of the fence. Yeah, that I know. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. No, we left that other one open and they ran in. Oh, you're right. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? We found a tent. We found a tent and some boxes. Nothing really useful. Seriously? No food? Jesus. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. Yeah, I bet. 
I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. What were you and Kenny arguing of him? What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. Oh, wow. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. How about your dad? Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Does he treat you like that, too? Does he treat you like that, too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that. But he's not a bad guy. You're right. He just... He's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much. And lost... Pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. Did you get the feeling something's going on here? Did you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Okay, asshole. Yeah, really. Let's go talk to the kids. The chillins. Oh, what's that? Look at cornfield. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. You'd be lucky if you get to stay here. Yes. Come in time. Hello. Oh, and duck. Oh, little baby. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. Oh. We'll um. see, Clementine. That's good. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say we give our little lady a hat? Yes. Here, Clementine. I don't know. My hat! You found it! I thought you didn't have time. I came across it by accident. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Hmm. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. <clears throat> hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I haven't thought about that in a while. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Hey there, Andy. Yeah? When do you think we might eat? Um, when do you think, uh, we might That's eat? That's on everybody's mind. Hungry, yeah. Huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Danny and I met a woman in the woods. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. 
Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. How's the cow? How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Thanks. Yep. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm, this smells funny in here. Like duty. <laughs> duty. <laughs> Kids. That wasn't a big deal. I know, literally. She looks skinny. Very innocent. Okay. Are right, you want to check some stalls? Lee body shaming a cow. I know. Damn. Get some weight on your bones. He's like, bro, why are you in here? Mm. Oh, they got another cow. I think that was the cow. Another salt oh, lick. Oh, yeah. You're right. Okay. Oh. I want to put in the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. You hunker down. I want to put in the hay. What? Shut up. Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. 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 Goodbye. This guy's gonna be like, "Why are you poking around the fucking barn?" Yeah. Okay. Oh. Empty. Okay. Should I try to use that door or should I check the rest of the stalls? Check the rest of the stalls. Okay. Oh. Look at this. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh. Smells pretty foul. Hmm. Is that a rat? Uh, yes. No, I don't know why I lied and said that. I don't know. Wow. Yes, it is, actually. Moo. Okay. All right, now let's see what's going on in this door. Mm. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff, and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. She's not actually my family. I'll protect her no matter what. <laughs> I know you will. Look, the guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, yeah. Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. What was that doing? Uh, Checking the screws yeah. or me. the bolts? You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? <laughs> well, you're, you know, urban. Oh, you are. Oh not my God! What I think you're saying? Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out <laughs> of my mouth. I'm from Florida. Sometimes. Sorry. Yeah, that's an excuse. Yeah. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly. Have a peek inside it, then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Just checking out the barn. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. 
farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hmm. Suspicious. I'll let sure they'll let us come back. Distract Andy to get him out of the barn. Okay. Hey there, Andy. Yes. Danny mentioned you needed something. He. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. We don't have a hammer. Well, we have a um, that Axe. little tool, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Fuck. We're not. Uh, hey, so one more time. Uh, hey there, Andy. Yeah? Danny needs something again. Well, we already... Okay, you want to say that again? Not really. Okay, well, do you, we have other choices. Yeah, but I don't think they're good choices. When you keep your... Where do you keep your tools? Mm-hmm. Or... Say that. So, where do you keep the rest of the tools? We're being well, if you need something, just tell me what it is, and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. Hmm. Okay, you want to say Danny needs something again? No, why do you lock that door? Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while and raid our stuff, even with the fence. Danny needs something again. Danny needs something again. All right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. Hmm. Oh, my goodness. I guess we're going to exit. Let's see. Picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Andy keeps coming back. I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. Oh. What about those generators? Smart. Smart. I should say so. Bye, you should have given that guy the multi tool. I know, I agree. <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh boy. I managed just fine. Plus, I had my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Let's see, shall we? Okay. I guess we'll just Come turn on, it off. Search. Access. Are the chickens baking? He's moving fast. Sorry. Ow, damn it. Man, he's moving running. fast. I know. Power oh, switch. shit, shit. They're, I feel like someone would see this. I do too. <clears throat> that thing is all too tight for my bare hands. What is he doing? I don't know. There, that should do it. Okay, well. He didn't turn it back on. No, because he's. He's. Oh. Sh Fucking Danny, where did he find this piece of shit? Oh, hey, come on, come on, come on! Damn it, Tom. Oh, son of a. Fuck! Okay, ooh, what's this? No mail coming in or out these days. What'd you say? A 
At least I said, let's check the mail, but bill the mail. Damn it. Take them up. Back in we go. All right, you think we're going to find something weird or no? None. Just make us look bad by being yes. suspicious. Right. Maybe lose our meal. Keep mm. it up. Yeah. Now close the door behind you. But they never do. Mm -mm. Okay, come on. Yep. Come on, come on, come on. Let's do this. Don't be in a hurry. I know, literally. Okay. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Oh my god! I'm nervous! I know, let's see. Get that multi-tool out. Oh shit, no, fuck off. Screws holding it to the Yes, door. yes, yes. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Thank you. You better hurry. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Uh oh. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Boy, did <gasps> you hear the bell? Dinner time. Okay. Why is there so much blood in there? Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Oh. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So That's true. See, I forgot we were on a farm. Nothing to worry about. Or is it? Yeah. He just left it open. I've been like, lock it back. Yeah, literally. Put the screws back in, and you Why jerk. is it locked? <laughs> true. Oh, Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mom? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Get him, girl. Okay. Look at scratches. I guess we could go upstairs. Yeah. Open medicine cabinet. What do you want to do? Go upstairs. Come on. <gasps> Come on, everyone. Shut up. I mean, keep talking. I never heard she used to be so loud. Mm -mm, me either. Shit. Is that blood? Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Here's another room. Right here. Well, and the bookshelf. Uh, farm books, cookbooks. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Oh, okay. Hurry up, dude. I know, seriously. He's not there. Mm -mm. They need so much morphine. morphine for candles. Smart. Musty as hell. <laughs> I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. 
Curvy tubes, saline. Wow. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Huh, where is that cord going? Okay. Maybe there's uh, farm books, mm. cookbooks. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Nothing else I can do in here? Hmm. I can do the cool I can do the hand for it. Sorry, I always miss that. What the hell? Okay, I'm nervous. How are they not noticing I'm gone? I know. I'm nervous. I knew that was gonna move. I know the placement of it was weird. Yeah. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. <gasps> what? Oh, <gasps> his leg! Mark. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> to your legs, man. Don't <gasps> eat dinner. <laughs> Clementine. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Bro, run down these fucking stairs. Go! Oh my god. Don't eat that. Don't eat that! What? Uh, huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Didn't the boy oh, sit your ass down, oh Lee. God, oh this lady god. has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee. What's gotten into you? Oh my god, duck's eating. Stop. You're they eating human meat. You're goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Go upstairs and have a look. I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. What? Everything oh could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. He got shot with oh, one arrow. Honey. Right. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better. Just let us go. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Clementine, run. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking out Don't of go here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, Somebody what do I something. Eat? Somebody do something! Lee! Lee! Ooh! Let go of her. Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Is that my guy? I don't know. I don't know. Please. Oh my god. Someone. <gasps> Come out. Oh. Fuck. Now what? Open the goddamn door. You can't keep 
Keep us in here! <coughs> Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bang. bare hand! We gotta find another way out of here! <coughs> Yo, shit! <coughs> fucking <coughs> bastards! <coughs> Open this door, goddammit! <coughs> I will knock the really goddamn door stuff. down! Stop! It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. Oh, but you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Okay. What happened? What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Get us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walker! Dad, please! Ooh, she's please just holding her stomach. Down. I wonder if it's just because she's nauseous. She just puked, too. So Pretty heavy. You think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? No such luck. No. That was too easy. Mm-hmm. Let us out now! Meat. If you wanna live, that is not Don't gonna wanna help. Know what kind. <laughs> They're not gonna open the door! Chairs are pretty sturdy. You, we could you climb up. Uh, but there's the right no way out through the ceiling. Dad, you can't get. Uh, uh, oh, here fucking we go. Idiot. Easy. Working yourself up. Oh god. Dad? No. Oh shit. Dad, no way. He's dead. Dad. Oh god. He stopped breathing. Oh my god. I think he's had a heart that attack. That was quick. Look at her starting her CPR he's immediately. Dead. Yeah. Good job, Somebody girl. Yep. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. He's gonna turn. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously mm. pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! The morning later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. No, god damn it! My dad survived worse than this! Look, Kitty, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. <clears throat> Remember what Ben said. We gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee! I need you! Please help me! Come on, Sorry. Dad. All right, Mom. Come on. Are we siding with Kenny, or are we going to side with her? Definitely Kenny. Wake up! You're right, Kenny. Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see! Oh, my oh, God! No. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! Okay. No, no, no! Damn. Mm. Let go of me! No, please! Mm. Oh, wow. No! Oh. oh my gosh. I didn't expect it to go that way. Damn! Oh my god, that just gave me chills. Mm. I'm sorry. I Don't know you we... fucking touch me! <laughs> Uh, Clementine. Clem. You okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. We couldn't take a chance. I'm sorry. We couldn't take that chance. You understand why we had to do this, Clementine. So we won't turn into one of those monsters? That's right. Damn. I know. I know. 
but you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? A safe place. Some place safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. Okay. Oh my god. Ugh. Okay, what do you want to do? Talk to Clementine again, talk to Kenny, talk to Lily, or talk to Kenny. look at Larry. Kenny. You, uh, you think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. It's just you and me. It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, she probably side with the St. John's against us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> True. Okay. Lily, Making I'm, shock I'm Lily. sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Oh, I just don't did because I don't know what to do right now. Okay. Larry would want you to move on. Mm. Larry would have wanted. Fuck you! You think he wanted this? Of course not. You don't know what he wanted. You never knew him. You never gave him a chance. Maybe not. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe I should have tried hard. Oh, fuck off. But I know he loved you. He'd want you to get out of here. Okay, um... Okay, look at I know it was necessary. But I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. Yeah. I worry what it's gonna do to her. Look at Larry, I guess. I don't know what the fuck you want me to do right now, y'all. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away. <laughs> if you okay, insist. Then. Oh, the air conditioning. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Okay, well, what's your Does idea, the bitch? Air conditioner come off. I think I could take it off. If I had something to remove the screws. You got a multi tool. Oh, multi -tool. Of you and Lee got the same brain. Yep. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. Mm -mm. Hmm. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. Okie dokie then. It's not coming off that mm -hmm. way. Okay. Well, let's take a look see around. Oh, you got a coin? Yeah. Can I Can search his pockets? Yes. The air conditioner might be our way out. If the duck behind the air conditioner is big enough, we might have found our way out of here. Yeah? But I need something to loosen the screws. I got nothing. Shit. Hang tight. Maybe I can scram something. Uh, Lily? Why can't you just leave I me know, alone? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor end, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. Oh, he did. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. Yes. If he was alive and had in the sense. key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission do what you have to do Thank let's you, get in those pockets <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps us change in just tap on Fuck top of the pocket sure. I was going to say who, why would she know yeah others don't worry I'm not taking it like why don't you take it yeah here we go two quarters noise 
Thanks, Larry. For once, you're useful. Which, what are the odds he'd keep those coins in his pocket three months after, yes. but whatever. True. There we go. Nice. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. Oh, this doesn't fall on Lee and kill him. I know. Well, there's our way out, Lee. It's too small to fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. So sweet. I knew it. You think you can do this? You think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. See you later, What is she gonna do when she gets up there? You're gonna be fine. That's a good question. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. God, I hope they were here. I know. Way you're I gonna stay him. here. Let her stay. It's not safe in here. For God's sake, Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. We ain't got time to play, girl. Yeah. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Bloody room's looking a little different now. Oh, I wonder if they're the ones who did the trap. Oh, I thought that when I saw I the trap. Up this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Mmm. That'll do some damage. Yes. Nice. Two weapons. Oh, oh, okay, wow. which would you rather have, the sickle or the other one? The other one. Okay, well, uh, I don't think it's gonna let me. Oh, oh wait, oh, it's right there, yeah. Oh, so you want the other one? Yeah. The hay hook? Okay. Okay, well, I hope Kenny takes one, you know? Yeah. Okay, let's see what's up here. Ooh. What is that, fingers? I don't know. I thought it was brains, but maybe that's intestines. Yeah. God, what's wrong with these people? Yeah. Okay, so that's where Clementine came out. Maybe I shouldn't have seen Clementine. <gasps> oh oh my god, yeah, that yes. sucks. Mm. Poor little girl. I mean, I know everyone's been through everything. But... Yeah. Ooh! Nice. Oh, okay, so do you want to keep the oh. taser or the hay hook? The hay hook. Okay, and then let's Why do we get rid of the um, camera? Put your people. What do you mean? We still have the, the camera. Oh, I thought you just put it on the edge of the um, thing. No, that was the taser. Oh. Oh, you're right, though. We don't have the camera anymore. Huh. So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yup. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Get down, Lee! Finishing the damn dinner first. 
Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Like a damn weirdo. Ooh! Wow. We died? I think we did, yeah, because I didn't act quick enough. Okay, here we go again. Oh, give it to me, bitch! Ugh. My ear! Get away with this fucking hook! Get your witch hook! Damn, I'm dead again! Sorry. Okay, grab the gun, boom! And then stick him with the hook. Oh, bitch! Oh. oh no, 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 thank god. Oh, good, he got the sickle. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Nice. Oh, that would hurt so bad. That would hurt horribly. Where's my family, asshole? You can't have them. We need the vet. No! <gasps> Cat! Lee, come on! Okay. Just go. I won't be far behind. Oh, what are we gonna do to him? Oh! Oh, dang! <gasps> you see? You understand now, don't you? No! You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I'm not going to volunteer to be food. What never volunteered to be food? You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like you didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. Uh -oh. Okay, mama. Kill him or no? Kill him. <laughs> He's gonna be a problem if you don't. Uh oh. No. Clementine saw that. Crap. And that wasn't a grain. No, it wasn't. Dang it. Nice job, yeah, mom. I know. Just kidding. Sorry, kid. God, no! Gotcha! Just go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Come on, come on. Yeah, you're right. He's gonna turn into a fucking walker. Yeah. You're right. Yep. I'm always right. <laughs> okay, then. Was that funny? Yeah, it was a little bit. Wow. Mm -hmm. Kitty! Beautiful house. Uh huh, gorgeous. Gorgeous. Get out of here. Get out of here. Why? What's going on? Ben, quiet. Tell me what's going on, Lee. I can help. Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. <laughs> her and her That's gun. Yep. Course. He's always Lee, ready. Be careful. Ooh, full moon. You always know people like crazy on yep. full moon. Absolutely. 
Oh my god, what is she doing to him? Oh. I'm a big boy, check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Settle down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? I left Danny in the barn. I left Danny in the barn. He got what he deserved. Alright, well, guess no more sneaking. I guess not. Oh god. Oh my Please god. Don't come in here. You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Go, Brenda. Open the screen door or what? Yeah, might as well. Let's see what happens. Please! Please don't you take another step! Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there! Uh -oh. I mean it. No! I told you to stop. I told you. Oh, well, that we've died want. a lot today. Yes, we have. You We're living and learning. Mm -hmm. around, what are our other options? Go, Brenda. Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there, uh -oh. I mean it. Okay, stop. It doesn't have to end like this. Put the gun back down, bitch. Do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Oh, oh, look, there's a zombie up there. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Maybe the zombie will get Brenda. Yeah. Let her go, Brenda. Let her go, Brenda. Please, listen to it. I'll do it! Please. What is that zombie doing? He's stuck on the railing. Oh, okay. Couldn't see him that well. I don't want to kill you, Lee! Please don't make it seem worse. Please don't make this any worse! Just stop! Yep, come on. A little bit further. Alright, keep going. Ah! Okay, nice. Ah! Stuck. Where's Teddy? We don't know. I said, don't move, asshole. Don't you fucking hurt him. Oh my god. Let us go, goddammit. Oh. Oh. That ain't gonna happen. Andy, go. Shut up. Ah! No. <sighs> Andy. Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done. Look what you've done. Yeah. You brought this on yourself. You brought this on yourself? No, uh-uh. You did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. Nice. Uh -oh. oh, come on. There we go. Nice work. Oh, fence is broken, damn it. Oh, I think we're going to use the fence to kill him. Uh-oh. Oh, fuck no. No way you're going to kill me with the fucking generator. Oh. No, 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 no. No fucking way. No fucking way. Um. No fucking way. Oh my god! Where's somebody with a gun? I know, seriously! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Someone grab that fucking gun and help me, help me, help me, help me! Oh! oh she's just watching! What? Come on! Are you fucking kidding me? Here we go.
I don't want to kill him in front of Clementine. Oh, I think you got to. Oh, you guys already seen Oh, you're right. I should have. You're right. Fuck. Okay. Come on. That was good work. And it didn't, I wasn't too violent. No, So that's wasn't. good. Yes. No, let's go see. Ooh, oh, he's alive. Is, is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit. I ain't shit. It's over. Fuck you. This dude is dead if I'm gonna get out here. You, you all fucked. <laughs> They're not coming. They're not coming. What do you mean? Lee? What the fuck do you mean? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! I would kill him and then take this property. Yes. Okay, Good wait. idea. Let's see. Oh. Okay, you want to go to them, or what do you want to do, Mama? Yeah, go uh, to them. Walk away or uh, deal with them? No, go go to them. Yeah. Right now, he's letting the guy suffer. Yeah. Which is good. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee. Lee! Oh shit. Alright, y'all. Oh. oh shit. Let's go. Come on, people. I know, seriously. God. I wanna know why she didn't help us out. I know because she's fucking pissed about her dad, but it's oh, like no, that's right. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh look, her the zombie mom is right there. Oh yeah. Probably gonna bite her son. Yeah. Back to the motel we go, yep. I guess. Didn't even get a good meal out of it. No, no, we didn't. Maybe they got the biscuits. Oh, yeah, they did get biscuits. Are you mad at me, Clementine? Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. Yeah. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? <laughs> yeah, they were. Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just, ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Oh, crap. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, that is. Oh, how's Kenny doing? <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. You got shot. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? We effed up. We fucked up. We fucked up real good. You can't say that, man. The rest of us are alive, aren't we? Yeah, I know. I've got your back. We made the right choice, but what the hell happens now? Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready to roll. Mm. I want you to come with us. I mean it. Okay. Yeah. They need that gas, though. Yeah, they come do. On, Clementine. Stay close. I was about to say, why the fuck is Clementine so far back? Did you have to kill those men? I'm sorry you saw that. I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Oh, God. Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Crap. 
car door is open. Oh, is this where, is this Glenn's car? No, he left in like a taxi or something. A pizza truck. Pizza yeah, car. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Don't shoot, we're here to help. Don't shoot, we're here to help. Why would someone leave this car here? Yeah. Oh, there's no gas. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. Oh, dang! Shit, food and supplies back here. Freaking a trunk full. Yeah. Score. Feel bad for whoever they were taking this, this from. This food could know. save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Girl. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? You're right. We shouldn't take this. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. We've done enough damage already. We've done enough damage already. What do you mean by that? Come on, Kenny. Between this and the meat locker, you know what it means. Fine. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Oh my uh, god, what? Oh. Okay. <laughs> we got it. I thought good. he was going to pull a gun out. I did too. Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? Like, we could just take See some of it, not all of it. Yeah. Here. At least Clementine knows you wouldn't have taken it. Yeah. Got it? Yeah. I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. Hmm. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. What about that? It's gonna get cold out eventually. True. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? <laughs> You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? No. Oh, God. Lee. Oh, you're gonna God. See this. Oh, shit. Oh, <gasps> what? Okay, so let's see. Um, chopped David's leg off. Okay, 84% of people did that. I don't know what you, I don't know what the other alternative yeah. is. 
You and 87% of players had Danny shoot Jolene. Yeah, because once again, I felt so bad for her freaking talking about how those guys took her daughter yeah. and did God yeah. knows what. You helped kill Larry. You and 31% of players helped kill Larry. Wow. Oh, so I guess you can side with her. Damn. Who knew? You killed both of the St. John brothers. You and 82% of people didn't kill both brothers. Put it there, Mom. We're good people. Stole food from the car. You and 44% of players didn't steal. Oh, wow. All righty. Okay, so what was your least favorite part of this when episode? When we found out they were eating humans. Yeah, me too. Or whenever we found out that poor Mark was got his fucking legs chopped off. Oh, I guess, yeah. I guess that was the same thing. Like, yeah. that was the same moment. Yeah. So, I just... I just, I don't understand at the end, I know it was our choice, but like in real life with Clementine getting upset yeah. about stealing the, I mean, I guess I see both sides. Yeah. Stealing the food and then also like, I don't know, just because it's like, it's our survival, you know? Yes. It's eat or be eaten. And we could have even just taken a little bit of this stuff. We didn't have to take yeah. all of it, you That's know, to be greedy. Too. Right. But... But yeah, I know. And then also with the whole thing with um, Lily's dad, do you think we did the wrong thing? No, I don't. I agree. No, I yeah. did. Because if you would have waited any longer, he would have probably turned. And then, yeah. and then it, like he said, a big fucking zombie's coming yeah. at you. So, okay. So I am curious for today's question. Lily's dad, did you help Kenny or did you help um, Lily? Oh, who did you guys give food to? I want to know that. Uh, yeah. Like, which characters you chose to give food to, if there was a different outcome. And I feel like there were other big choices we made, but I can't We made of, a lot of choices. A lot of choices. Yeah, if we ever do something differently that you guys didn't do, let us know. And then yeah. let us know, like, if there's a different outcome, blah, blah, blah. Obviously, if there's no spoilers. Um, but yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I'm loving this. I'm I loving am this too. game. Like, it's really fun. so freaking fun. Yeah. I know. Like, I, I literally, even though we just finished that episode, I was like, oh my God, I wish we could play more, but we have to pace ourselves. Yes. Um, but thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Oh, I like it. W. Mm hmm. For As winner. We... Oh, yeah, I like it. Okay. Oh, okay. Wait. Hi, y'all. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. <laughs> Hi, y'all. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption And why am I saying y'all? Hi, y'all. Welcome back to...